people feel overwhelmed because that color doesn't go with that color. You know, um, that print doesn't go with that print. And yet I'm showing you it all goes together. Regalia is something that you wear to, again, for special ceremonies, separate, uh, special occasions. The concept of adornment and um, wearable art, I was on the forefront of that for many years, and this would exemplify that we don't wear garments that have to be quote unquote in style to be fabulous and wonderful and celebrate who we are. This is not a costume. This is regalia. It's um, from the early 90s, and this is where I was in spirit. This is what I would call my spirit regalia. This is what captured uh, the energy of January as a queen, as a priestess, a healer, as a warrior woman. Um, fighting on the side of justice and righteousness, and fighting on the side for art that helps liberate the mind. And it was only after I shed myself of the other dress that I was able to create a grander, what I call a grander dress. And I wanted the dress to make a statement of, number one, as I believe in people, all colors go together. There should be no separations. And we should celebrate ourselves by wearing colors and come out of the drab world of gray, black, brown. We should want to be a celebration of life. And we are in divine order when we work from that mode. So this really captures the early me. This is little sister, and now I'm wearing the big sister. The world is a collage, so when we start to think of that or ourselves as being a part of that uh, uh, celebration of bringing various elements in and creating one thing from it, I want to make things that celebrate who we are in spirit. And I want to, people, other people might want to say, I won't wear all of that, but maybe I'll wear a little bit more colorful. Uh, uh, clothing or adorn, adorn myself or celebrate myself.